I'm making up rhymes. Phantom Flame is an awesome name. So many rhymes. I'm going insane. Hello there, everypony! Welcome to another episode of Star Stable! And in this episode, we're gonna be buying the new Jorvik Wild Horses, the new color-changing ones that are the big shires and stuff. I'm really excited to check them out. Uh, I've seen a couple of them run around here. There's a couple of them there, two of the, uh, the black ones over there. So we bought the uh, other Jorvik Wild Horses before, the uh, like Icelandic model ones. We have those three already, and now we're going to go ahead and buy the other three. And I am just going to go ahead and buy all three since they are a limited time one. I don't know if they'll be bringing them back or not. Here's like the original uh, Jorvik horses here. I mean the wild ones. The, there's the blue one. And then there's the purple one over here who I have like never ridden hardly ever. <laughs> uh, Crimson Peak is around here somewhere. I, I don't know where he is. He's somewhere. There he is. So yeah, so we have the other three already, so I figured it was a good idea to go ahead and get the other ones. First, I do need to probably put some horses into the pasture though. I don't have enough room, I don't think, in my stable in order to get out of the other horses. This is hard though, I hate having to send horses off to Horse Island and such. But it must be done until I make more room in the stable. So we'll go ahead and send a Winter Rebel off to the, the place. How do we do that? I actually haven't sent any horses off uh, to the thing yet. How do we do this? Do we drag and drop? Oh, we do! There we go! There you go. Sorry, Winter Rebel. I'm going to miss you. Alright, so we have room for uh, one, one, two horses, I think. So we need to send one more horse off to Horse Island. I don't know who to send. I don't want to send any of you. Or not Horse Island. I'm still so used to old Star, st old star Stable stuff that I'm not even... I don't even know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a little out of it. Who else should we send? I don't want to send any of you. Whoa. I don't know. Dragon Tornado. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm gonna send you back to, uh, over to the, whoops, over to the pasture. As much as I love you, buddy, I need to, I need some room here. So we will send you off, off there too. Alrighty. Now, 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 I believe we can go off to wherever we gotta go. Fir Grove. Fir Grove is where we're gonna go. We're gonna go over here and buy the wild horses. Yay! Alrighty, so they should be right... Oh, I see them. Yep, right over here. Right over here. Oh, I'm so excited. I kind of am not excited about the fact that there's been so many horses coming out and so many I want to buy and, you know that fact but the horses are pretty cool looking alrighty what do we got here what do we got here okay so we got the pretty white one which looks like all like all looks like a party basically this one looks like a party and then we have this pretty uh, brown and green one here oh he's very pretty very pretty and then we also have uh, the, there is the one per person riding that one right now the blue and black one here. Really, really cool. So these are all ones uh, made after like that Galloper Thompson thing from Halloween. Like they're the Shire model, but like with a different mane and tail, I guess. Like, are they a little shorter than the Shires? I don't know. We'll figure that out when we get all of them. We, um, I'll pull the Shire, my, uh, my Shire out from my stable and we can compare them and such. Let's go ahead and buy these guys. And actually, I have some of the names figured out for them already ahead of time here. So, uh, yes, they are slower too, which kind of sucks. I don't know why they have to be slower than regular horses. All right, here it says, Jorvik Wild Horse. Around Jorvik's looks uh, accessible hard. Okay, this is probably all the same stuff as the other, as the other thing said. And I, I don't feel like reading them all. Yeah, and uh, Jorvik horses, Wild Horse is not as fast as other horses. Okay. These ones are also a little bit more expensive, I guess, than the other ones were. I don't remember what they were, but if you look back at my video, which I will post a link to when I bought the other ones, uh, it'll have the price of whatever those ones were before. So these ones are a little expensive, which makes me a little more reluctant to buy them all, but I'm going to anyway because, again, limited time horses. I, yeah, anyway, let's go. Choosing the name for him, I'm going to name him. Let's see if I can find the right words here. Can I just say to you how annoying it is to me that the words are like not completely in alphabetical order? Halfway, like some of them are, 
and then like it like redoes it and then it's not I don't know it's really weird I don't know why they don't have just everything in alphabetical order on these uh, lists here like for example they have words that start with the letter F down here but then they also have words that start with the letter F up up here so it's like so confu uh, confusing anyway I'm gonna name this guy Phantom Flame I think that's really cool he is there's I don't know why I think of fire when I see him he's like a blue the blue fiery flames and I don't know I think he's really cool and so I think phantom name a uh, phantom <laughs> phantom name I'm going insane I'm making up rhymes okay <laughs> phantom flame is an awesome name so many rhymes yes phantom flame we'll say okay and we'll buy him congratulations on your new horse eh? alrighty and then I will go and buy the other other two here and the names for the other two I'm not a uh, hundred percent sure on I have I have ideas for them but I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna be naming the pink one let's go to the mr. green guy over here he is really cute I guess his like normal non magical color is really cool too like just really pretty color I think I'm going to name you oh dollar chaser that's not bad <laughs> um just randomly there already okay we're going to name you I'm trying to decide between Lucky Clover or Lucky Lime for him. I wanted something related to green, so that's why I thought Lime or Clover, or I guess a dollar works too, but... So, I'm kind of thinking, uh, well he's not very clover -y, clover color, but he's not really Lime color either, so I'm not really sure what to call him. I guess Lucky Clover sounds the best maybe if i can find it you see it's so confusing i just i'm getting frustrated by these annoying non-alphabetical ordered things of names and i i don't know i don't know but okay lucky clover let's just go with that i think that's cute mr lucky clover so now we shall go and buy the pink rose this horse just reminds me of like a drag queen basically she's so so much just a lot going on she just has that vibe to her she has like a party girl vibe i don't know i, I like her for some reason though she's she's a little bit a lot of pink but also just a lot of sass i kind of like it so the name i really want for her is cake baby because in the movie Bridesmaids, Annie's restaurant is called Cake Baby, and I think that would be such a cute name for her, Cake Baby. But I don't know if baby is the... I know there's like the baby for the first word, but I don't know if you can do it for the second word. So unfortunately, it doesn't look like that the word baby is on here for the second thing. I, if it is, I can't find it. Okay, so I can't give her the name uh, Cake Baby, which is what I really wanted. But I just realized that I can name her Party Cake, which is also equally as perfect so party cake it is also why are they playing the like fishing fishing music i don't know why they're doing that playing the fishing music in this area i just now realized that why they are playing that music here i have no idea but yay we bought all of the horses so now it is time to go back to our home stable and uh play around with our new horses yay Oh boy, here we go. We got ourselves some new horses. There's Party Cake. And we got our other old ones here too, which I'm going to be probably lining them all up together for no reason. I don't know. Well, I don't know what I'm saying. Phantom Flame and then whatever, whatever I named you. Lucky Clover. Awesome, awesome. Let's put you away for now. Then now let's go and play with the uh, new horses. Who shall we ride first? I guess we'll pick you since you are closest. No, I didn't want that. Go back. Go back, Mr. Uh, Mr. Game Thing. What? I don't even, I have no idea what I'm saying. I'm going insane. Why isn't it letting me open the door? There we go. In, in the stall. In the stall. There we go. There we go. Let's get up on him. Woo! Okay. He is a big boy. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Look at those pretty blue eyes. Oh my goodness, he's so pretty. Oh, he has a fancy walk. Is it just me or does he have a fancy walk? That's a pretty fancy walk if you ask me. He's like strutting his stuff. Uh-huh, he's just like, uh-huh. Just strutting my stuff, just strutting my stuff. Oh, he's so pretty. Look at that crazy mane. That mane is insane. Insane mane. Very crazy. Oh, he's super cute though. 
All right, let's let's get party cake over here too. I realized I could have named her party girl, I think too. That would have worked also. But I like party cake. Party cake, party cake. She kind of like a big pinky pie, big pinky pie horsey. Party cake, look at you. You got a fancy little fancy little strut going on too. Let's put you beside him. And then now let's go get uh get lucky clover. I'm actually really liking all these guys. They're really cute. They are super cute and super big. Yep, come on. Get on the horsey. Get on the horsey. On the horsey. There we go. And now we'll just set you right next to the rest of them. There we go. Look at that. You are all lined up and pretty. And now lastly, I'm going to go and uh, get my Shire just because I want to compare the sizes of them. I'm guessing they're pretty much the same size. But I'm curious if they are any, uh, ooh, any size differences going on. Okay. What is this doing? Back, d d d door open up, please. Hello, thank you. I need to ride this girl more often, too. She is, like, super pretty. I forget how pretty she is. She's very pretty. All right, so let's see how they size up. It looks like, uh, pretty much the same. I don't know. Are these guys just slightly taller? They might be slightly taller. I'm not sure. We could just be standing at a weird angle. No, it looks like about, I guess they're about the same. About the same in size. Yeah, we all, all in the same size here, everybody, I guess. I don't know. What is going on? I have no idea. Aaron McGurish, look at all the big horses. You guys are huge. Okay, so they look pretty much the same then. I guess like the only difference is their manes are different. I think their tails are pretty much the same. I don't know, are their tails different? No, their tails are the same, so really the only thing that's different is their manes and of course their colors and their uh, magical powers and such. But there's a little comparison of, of all these horsey butts. <laughs> Alright, so we'll put Moon Pearl back now. So let's take each of these guys out and see what they look like with their, uh, whoa, what is going on? With their, um, I'm stuck in horse butts here. Uh, let's see what they look like in their normal, non-magical colors. Let's take a clover, lucky clover out first and see what his non-magical color looks like. Woo, and there he goes. Oh my goodness, he has a very, woo, very pretty, very pretty uh, normal looking horse color. It is really pretty, oh my gosh. And I love the little kind of weird shading they got going on on his feet so you can see like all his feathery feathers going on. All his fluffy feetsiness. And his mane is just crazy. I will admit, I actually might want to uh, check out, like, you know, where you can, the, like, hairstylist thing, the mane stylist, whatever it's called. I may end up giving them different manes if uh, they let you do that. Let's go take Phantom Flame out now. Boom! Okay, so he is just uh, all black. Although this is actually cool. He does look a little bit, um, he's not all black. He's, like, gray, like a dark gray, and then he's got super black mane and tail and feathers. So that honestly looks super cool. Oh my gosh, he actually looks really nice. Like his normal color is pretty cool too. Like he's he's rocking it. Oh my goodness, I love him. He is so cool. These new horses are so amazing. All right, now let's take Party Cake out and see what her normal color is because I actually haven't really seen it too much. Oh, she's so cool though. I love her. She's just a total... Total party girl. She is so, so like funfetti cake looking. It is so cool. I just love the spots on her back here. Like she's got like turquoise pink and like a little bit of orange. Like little spots on there. Little splattery spots. Looks like somebody just took a paintbrush and splattered paint on you. Or like you're a funfetti cake. I don't know. She's just super pretty. <laughs> Whoa, what's her normal color look like? Oh my gosh, it's a weird color. I will admit, I am not, um, well, I don't know, actually it is kind of cool. I was going to say, like, from the picture, it didn't look very good, like, her normal color was just kind of, I don't know. Compared to her, like, pink funfettiness, she, like, this is definitely toned down a lot. But, this is still pretty cool, though, like, I don't even know what color she's supposed to be, I'm guessing some kind of weird Appaloosa or Roan, I don't know, this really doesn't look like a real horse color at all. But she's, oh, or I guess she's like a flea bitten gray. Maybe that's what she's supposed to be. Maybe a flea bitten gray? Is that what you're supposed to be? I don't know. Kind of cute though, and I like this like crazy uh, colors. Like, I mean, the color, like the tan, mane and tail, and a feathery feet. I don't know. She's really pretty. I like her. I'm liking her. I'm liking all of them. 
And now I kind of want to take uh, take them out and like have them like go a little rides off with them and stuff. But like, I don't even know which one to take because I like them all. Oh my gosh, they're so cool. They're super cool. I feel like they do have a little bit of a different like animation to them, maybe though. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just crazy. That's very well a big possibility. I just love them. They are so cool. I am totally glad I bought all of them. Alrighty, now, I think something that'd be kind of fun is to maybe line up all the wild horses together. I don't know, maybe that's just me that thinks that would, that would be fun. I'm going to line up the uh, old horses, the older, or the last year's Jorvik wild horses with this year's Jorvik wild horses. Blue Magic can go beside, uh, beside the big blue horse here. They actually have like similar blues it looks like, similar colors of blues going on. Oh my gosh, they look really cute together, actually. They look awesome together. Oh my gosh, the old, uh, the old little horses. Uh, they're so tiny compared to the Shires. Let's get uh, Opal Nova here. Now, Opal Nova is definitely... I need to ride this one more. I never ride this one. Like, never. I need to take her out more, because honestly, she is everything. Like, she's weird, but she's cool about it. Like, I don't know. She's cute. All right, now you need to go with uh, Party Cake. Party Cake and Opal Nova together. Perfect, pink and purple. And then lastly, Crimson Pink, where are you? There you are. Get your butt over here. Actually, you would look good next to the one horse too. To uh, uh blah, 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 blah. Yeah, Phantom Flame, you'd look good next to him too with the, with the red and the black and the blue. Yeah, that's pretty cool, that's pretty cool. All right, we're gonna set you beside, beside what's his name here, Lucky Clover, Mr. Leprechaun Man. That's what he reminds me of, Mr. Leprechaun. He looks like a leprechaun. I don't know what words I'm saying. All right, so here we go. We have all the horsies together. Would you look at that? Ooh, I'm sorry, I'm spinning the camera around so much. Look at that, look at all the horses. All the wild horses together. That's pretty cute. That is pretty awesome and cute right there. Oh my gosh, I love them all. Totally, totally worth getting all of them, I think, and yeah, I just really love them. I know some people don't like the fact that there's like, oh, unrealistic colored horses and whatever, but I honestly don't care. Star Stable is such a weird game already and already has weird magic stuff going on, so I'm totally cool with unnatural colored horses, and these guys are super cute. Oh my gosh, I love you guys. Okay, this is also making me really want uh, for Star's Table to one day maybe be able to have it so you can pony like another horse with you. That would be so awesome. Like seriously, like riding this guy while like leading this guy, leading a little blue magic along with you. That would be so awesome. Like they should definitely think about doing something like that. Like a pony thing where you can lead another horse with you. That would just be so fun. At least I think that would be fun. Oh my gosh, I'm just so happy about all three of these. These are so, so, so pretty. And I honestly like them a lot more than I even thought I would. Like, just seeing the picture of them, I was like, oh, those are okay. Like, I just wasn't super thrilled about them. But actually seeing them here in the game, they are pretty darn awesome and adorable. Okay, so I just discovered here from the horse stylist that you can't actually change their manes at all, I guess. I'm... I'm surprised because I thought you could on the other ones. I guess you can't though. So it looks like Crazy Mane is going to have to stay on this guy. Although I would kind of like to make his name different. Apparently I can't. That's really interesting. I seriously was expecting that you could change their manes or whatever. And also yes, I do need a Mustang. I am going to be putting the Mustang that I'm playing with on the uh, app game. I am going to put that in the game and I'll be doing a video on that too when that happens. But I also may end up getting another colored Mustang at some point too. I don't know, there's so many pretty horses now in Star Stable. It is like so hard to keep up with them all and uh, it's just impossible. It's impossible to keep up with all the pretty horses and there's so many I'd like to have and I'm just like, can't keep up with all of them. Alrighty guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here then. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you all have a super duper awesome wonderful day and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone!